Muy buenas chicos, ¿cómo están? Sean bienvenidos. Voy a ver el live stream, chicos. Ahora sí voy a verlo en vivo. Así que si alguien lo vio antes, por favor, ya saben, como siempre, déjenme por ahí abajito su comentario. Los que estamos aquí en la transmisión del día de hoy, que estamos viendo, el, vamos a empezar a ver el live stream. Eh, pues no comenten nada, déjenme spoilearme solito. Pero por lo menos ya acabo de ver. Me spoileé un poquito en el sentido de, de haber visto a la personaje. Bueno, la vi en el fotito, me llamó la atención. Y ahora estoy viendo, ahora que cargué el live stream. Estoy viendo que aparece al principio. ¡Wow! ¡Qué guapa está el personaje! Me recordó mucho a Amber, la verdad. Es la Amber de, de esa zona, yo creo. Así como lo fue esta. ¿Cómo se llama? Colei también parece ser que es eso. Dice. Venga. Sí, 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 sí. ¡Wow! ¡You must be the legendary traveler! Valgamer. ¡Oh! Dice. ¡Oh! ¿Are you following la the versión. tournament too? It's a Perreo. pleasure to meet you. I'm Charlotte, a reporter for the Steambird from Fontaine. ¡Oh! Se llama Charlotte. ¡Qué bonito nombre, güey! The King of Invocations Grand Prix. Since you've also taken interest in the tournament, how would you like to be a special contributor for my column? Claro, yeah, of course no? you'll receive payment as a contributor, and your name will even appear in the credits. If I'm not mistaken, ah, me gustó el diseño, está guapísimo, bo. Así tipo, right? no sé, bo. Listo, valga mer. Genial. Story, don't I? Esa tipa es like una de Onkai. Solid piece. I can see it now. Exclusive inside scoop on the Conoce renowned todo sobre el, el nombrado viajero y los secretos de los jugadores del torneo. How does that sound? ¿Qué te parece? Yeah, nice eh, suena it, bien, right? suena bien, ¿no? Sí. It's just a working title for now. Any journalist worth their salt knows how to look past the surface and get the real story on any breaking news. But it's important to always keep the stories based on actual Buenazo. facts. We can always discuss more details. Bueno, ya, te puedes ir, ya me presentaste. I'll be covering the latest stories from the King of Invocations Grand Prix. But I'll definitely be keeping my eyes open for any other potential news leads. When it comes to breaking news, I'm always the first on the scene. Y nunca ha aparecido. Entonces, la primera en llegar. More exciting news waiting to be uncovered. So let's have a look. No, me, me llamó acá de este lado tenía una una cosa de su de su de, de hmm? Do my ears deceive me? Or do you two have some breaking news to share with me? Oh. Ah, vale, otra vez a... Otra vez no vamos a mostrar. Oh, no hay personas. Ah, cabrón. Ah, también Kazuha va a salir, venga. Bolts are way to the semifinals, only to be stunned by a crafty opponent. Oh, saying that in the presence of me and no, the design is so beautiful, loco. I think it's a good idea. Lol, qué guapo el diseño. Tired after the walk back to shore, perhaps I should let you go first. El gato, el gato, el gato en la caja. Tournament. Hola, sí, no. The tournament has already finished. I used forbidden hand at the opportune moment. Mano prohibida is. Rest assured, there's no destination I can't deliver to. El gatito, el gatito. Mira. Oh, pega patada, huevón. What the fuck, huevón. No se supone que era que era la mierda esta. Oye, ¿y es 5 estrellas o 4, Chris? Lol, qué guapo. Esa creo que es la personaje que dijeron que iba a aparecer de, de, de Fontaine. Cristo Valdemar. Pero que no iba a ser jugable. Eso dice. Sumeru? 4. There are so many huge mushrooms here. They're big enough to lie on. Ay, Dios, mi madre vuelve otra vez ilusionada, bro, para que la vuelvan a dejar estafada, bro. Ah, ese es el viaje, es cierto, de la misión que iba a hacer ella en Sumeru. Venga, uh, vale, el código ya lo tengo. Así que F por ahí. ¿Quieren parar el video? Bueno, lo pueden parar, pero si no, no. Venga, ahora sí, vamos a ver qué nos traen de nuevo. A ver. Hello everyone. Está. Welcome to the Genshin Impact version 3.7 special program. I'm your host, Sarah Miller Cruz, the voice of Lumine. And I have a new friend here with me. Make sure the truth comes first and report stories that stand out the most. 
This is reporter Charlotte from the Steambird. A pleasure to meet you. El pájaro vapor. Hey, everybody. I'm Maya Alquitaro, the voice of Charlotte. And as mentioned just now, Charlotte is a reporter from Fontaine, and she's currently working for the Steambird, which many of you may have probably already heard of. Oh, for sure. It's been mentioned no, no, in several no. places throughout the game now. And if I remember correctly, Mona also writes a column for the Steambird. So it seems like it's pretty famous, and people all across Nevada are reading it. Yes, that's right. But I'm not the only special correspondent in our special program today. Ooh. We also have other special correspondents reporting from the field that will help us bring all the information we need about this upcoming version. So exciting! Okay, I bet everyone's ready to see what we have in store, so why don't we dive right in? <laughs> okay, seems there's Whoa. quite a lot there's going on in the picture something. here. I see a couple familiar faces. And let me guess, the cute one in the middle with pink hair and a camera in her hands must be Charlotte, right? Ooh, that's right. <laughs> Charlotte's the one. <laughs> the Amber, well, no she's a journalist, after all, so she's got her equipment ready casi at all times. Como Amber, well. So in the upcoming version, Charlotte will be appearing in the event storyline, where she'll be dispatched to cover a popular Genius Invocation TCG competition. Given that the competition is an international event, Charlotte will be heading to several nations to gather Cristo news Valdemir. materials. Okay, that explains why we see so many friends from different nations in the picture here. Does that mean that she's going to be traveling around to that then? <laughs> you bet. As a foreign correspondent, she'll definitely be checking out the es que el diseño todo apunta que es como Amber. So, o sea, similar, pues, como Cole, pues. TCG journey. Que se parecen. Uh -huh. However, a keen and active reporter like Charlotte won't only focus on the Genius Invocation TCG event, even though that's really important. But during this journey, she will also be investigating a very strange case alongside the traveler. Ooh, a strange case, huh? Okay, that does actually sound really newsworthy. Yeah, right? But uh, that's all I can share for now. The mystery will be yours to gatito, no me había que está el gatito ahí abajo. So, if you want to find out what happens, gato. make sure you don't miss out. Yay! We hope our travelers have a great time in this event. In addition to the event storyline we just introduced, the Adventurers Guild has also prepared some other event mini games to spice up the TCG tournament. Vale, corona, right. un arco nuevo. Four event game modes, including vale, cuatro estrellas, un arco, la mejora, ever motion mechanical painting, and heart of the dice. In a tour of wonders, the organizer has set up checkpoints in various nations. After you complete the required challenges by navigating obstacles or defeating monsters, you'll be able to obtain commemorative stamps at the checkpoints. So collect more of these stamps during your sightseeing tour to obtain the corresponding rewards. Okay, I see. So the stamps will be like proof of your experience traveling in different nations during the event. You know, just like collecting stamps and a passport. Exactly. Next, we have Zero Hour Invocation, which is an unofficial tournament organized for our passionate TCG players. Unlike the official tournament matches, this format adopts a special rule set, so you won't be able to use your own decks. Oh. Instead, you will have to build a deck by selecting cards out of the decks prepared vale, by the organizers. Vale, eso es bueno para ganar experiencia y es bueno para probar otros decks. Against some familiar faces. Eso me parece okay. buena idea. <laughs> Sounds like fun already. All right, what about Evermotion Mechanical Painting and Heart of the Dice? I think many of our travelers have played Evermotion ah, Mechanical Painting lucido. before, but this game introduced me to the new one from Fontaine has undergone a few changes. De, no so this time around, el que jugamos, time around, you can adjust the position of Mechanical Painting surfaces by swapping the right hand right hand right hand 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 and then you can install the appropriate 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 how awesome is that? That's going to be so cool. And based on the people we've met, you should never underestimate Fontaine's pursuit of mechanical designs. Cristo but of Valgamer. course, I'm sure our keen Dice, travelers should be able to restore those paintings no with just a few extreme. attempts. Or more than just a few Algo attempts. Así. If people need it. <laughs> y no lo sabía. <laughs> Tenía Cristo el entrenador. Part of the Dice, which is a combat Cristo game Valgamer. mode. During combat, Dice. you'll be able to obtain random Entrenando. elemental dice by defeating monsters. Use mm -hmm. the suppressive roll skill to consume all the dice you possess and unleash a shockwave that deals damage to nearby opponents while also granting este otro random más de, more dice de se llama de the matar monos a los pendejos como siempre will result in greater damage dealt by the shockwave no tiene otra puta idea de, 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 buffs. Okay, bro, matanza, these are some special dice Digo, so yo sé que el juego trata de eso verdad pero <laughs> yep and travelers Oye, no tienen otra idea o sea, nada más le cambian el formato de ganarlas a las bendiciones para 
aumentar el daño. Pero al final la misma pendeada de aumentar el daño. A new four star bow called Ibis Piercer, along with its exclusive refinement materials. Yay! So exciting! <laughs> all right, that's all we have regarding the main event in the upcoming version. Clips random On black. to our next correspondent. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. That would be árbol. all for the version event. I still have black. something else to report. Dice. Oh, okay. In Orale. version 3.7, there will not only be a genius invocation event, but also a major Pero update to the TCG game itself. What? Ah, la actualización. Oh, okay, that's awesome. What can vale, we expect to see in the new update then? So, in the upcoming version, many new cards will be Alice added Hydra. to Genius Invocation TCG, Bienvenido, amiga, including roba, character pajaro, cards, mi árbol. monster cards, and action cards. Amazing, right? <laughs> yeah! And it's also noteworthy that the cards of the Animo, Geo, Electro, and Dendro Archons will also be available after the update. So we can expect o sea, to see some incredible and fun new decks. Nice! Pero es la principal. Okay, that's gonna be quite Clips the update. Black. And there's more! So, Dice. With so many cards Nuevo being added, how could we fully enjoy them without some new game modes? So, in version 3.7, the Arena of Champions mode will be available too. And, and what will be different campeones. about this mode? Glad you asked. In this mode, travelers must use their deck to duel against each other and accumulate a total of five victories. Ooh. As you can imagine, that can be a serious test even for a seasoned duelist. Plus, three defeats will result in a failed challenge attempt, and you'll have to start all over. So, if oh you're no. feeling yeah, if you're feeling confident about your deck and your TCG skills, then be sure to come to the Cat's Tale and give it a shot. Okay, that sounds okay. pretty intense. No tengo problema. Cualquiera de mis decks ha ganado hasta tres, cuatro, tres, cuatro. No, he ganado hasta tres veces. He ganado seguida. No worries, I got you. Okay, so another o sea, TCG mal, está mal, está is called the Forge Realms Tower, which will also be available. You'll be allowed to configure the difficulty of the game mode, as well as to choose from Listo a bunch Valgamer. of additional Difícil conditions to score extra points. Solo okay, tres. Perfect. I'll definitely be no, solo some tres porque ya no seguí jugando, nada más <laughs> esas eran las que necesitaba jugar. What, what's what happening? <laughs> what is going that on? That sounds cute. Where is it coming from? <laughs> <laughs> ah, I got otra. so caught up in listening to you two talking that I almost forgot that I'm on the job. Anyway, here I am. Aww. Aww. I have an urgent delivery for you. Please sign here, and I'd really appreciate it if you could leave me a good review. Thank you. Oh my gosh. So cute. Vale, es... Irara. ¿No? Vale, el siguiente código. Oye, pues va muy rápido, ¿o no? Siento yo que va muy rápido. Correspondence this ah, no, ya he visto. Ah, qué pedo, van corriendo las muñequitas aquí, bro. ¿Qué muñequitas serán esas? Es Kirara y la otra, ¿no? Parece Kirara y, otra, y la otra rojita. Dice. Excited to be here. No, Dios, una versión inmersiva. Vete a la verbo que no existe. Cristo Valgamer. Dice, Miauri, el 90% de la Live Stream es diciendo triple la que bonita la gatita X. Okay, so no, pero esta gatita está más grande, bro. Esta gatita sí me gusta, no es chibi. Yup, that's just Kirara's job. She is a courier like no other. More like Además, ¿cuánta estrella la va a tener todo el mundo? Meowster for that. No es como que sea muy exclusiva, que digamos. But before we get to hear more about Kirara, why don't we check her out first? Yeah. Yay! Let's do it. Wow, the scenery here is wonderful. Ay, de Nazuma. Carajo. <laughs> I've landed the perfect job. Pero no quejar que era vos. O oh, es mi idea. Yo tenía idea de que era arquera, ¿no? El gatito. Service with a smile. Glitch Random Black. Dice. Es que pone escudo, por eso me recordó oh solo por un momento a Dios. So cute. So cute. Tiene colita y su Random Black. That's the most adorable thing I've ever Ahí seen. Ahí te lo dicen en el directo. Oh, no. Did you guys see her in the little box? It was like, oh, she coming. Oh, she coming. Also, her ult is like really cool. I'm so cute. Jellies. I want to eat the jellies. <laughs> Kiara works as a courier for Comania Express and often makes international deliveries. She's also a yokai from Inazuma called a Nekomata and there's nothing she can't deliver. Oh, okay, that explains, like, the cute little kitty cat tails and why her shoes are, like, those cute little cat claws. They have, like, the toe beans at the bottom, and I want a pair. So, uh, actually, uh, those are just her regular feet. 
Oh, that's very nice for Kirara. Uh, even though she could es use her yokai ligera. powers to have human feet, she's still a Nakamata and feels more comfortable using her own claws to move. Yo tenía idea de que era, de que era arquera, They really are. And also, Kirara has two tails. Can you tell us anything about Oye, that? Oye, entonces sí la quiero. Oh, yeah, it, it said that the tail Yo no quería sacarla, has pero... Potential. So, with two pero sí la quiero, si tiene... Kirara is a really powerful yokai. Some bandits might assume that Kirara is an easy target. Te juro que esa... Te juro que yo leí que era de... Era, era de arquero, bro. But they are in no fact sé dónde madre esa que era de arquero. Bro. Always ends with the bandits running off after she gives them a good thrashing. Está siendo pal, ¿eres buena o entonces? So bueno, awesome. debe ser buena. <laughs> Kitty cat girl boss. <laughs> like, okay, and having no, her no, as your courier basically like determines that your package is going to get there safe. That is incredible service. Oh yeah, no doubt about that. Kirara is a very responsible worker and will do her best to ensure every order she receives is delivered. Clips of course, black. if the client can Dice, spare a meow man, she doesn't mind receiving a good review. Oh my gosh, she is so cute and diligent. I would definitely give her an extra tip right on the spot. Ah, le va a propina, like, encima. Catnip, fish, mora, whatever she wants. <laughs> okay, so... How did a yokai from Inazuma end up working as a delivery person? What is what's the what's the line there? Okay, well, if you think about it, the yokai in Inazuma do seem to have a mix of jobs. So, True. Yeah. well, speaking of which, even though Kiara is a strong yokai, she does care about her work and enjoys her job. She also enjoys human society, fashion, going to places she's never had the chance to visit before. Her deliveries give her a way into human society and also allows her to explore new places. To her, working is basically like getting to take a series of uh, <clears throat> expense-free trips. <laughs> Wait, you know what I just realized? Charlotte is technically traveling for work too. So maybe they can get together and enjoy some expense-free outings. Nina Tela. Okay, I think everyone Bienvenido is waiting to learn more about this yokai courier's abilities. Oye, me cambié el... Ni cambié el ese al de Genshin, loco, no me lo fijé. Kirara is a Dendro Element Sword user and can effectively use her companions while also making world exploration more efficient. Okay, her attacks look amazing. She swipes just like a cat using its claws. I love it. Yeah, she is a Nekomata after all. Additionally, her exploration talent allows her to move near birds or other smaller animals without startling them. She's an apex predator. I love it. That's so cool. No, la Charlotte no. La Charlotte nada más la iban a presentar. Es de no es personaje de 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 ninguna nación todavía. Es de Fontaine. No hace nada más que hablar así. Sorry. Sass me. <laughs> well, she's always going to keep you well fed, no matter the means. Uh, by tapping her elemental skill, Kirara creates a dendro shield that can protect her from harm. Okay, shields are great. They'll keep both her and the delivery safe, which is all that matters. Bienvenido a mi arroba pajaro a mi árbol. The elemental skill will not only grant shields, but also put Kirara in a unique state. Cool. So the whole thing is that that's the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life, and I need you to immediately tell me more about it right meow. <laughs> oh, no problem at all. Thank you, yes. In this state, Kirara will deal dendro damage upon slamming into enemies, but more uniquely, this state will also drastically increase her movement and climbing speed, along with her jumping ability. Okay, um, that sounds super useful. <laughs> so, just so I can get this straight... Esa puede ser buena para meter bastante dendro. Oh, yeah, she'll be able to go straight up a vertical surface Clips in this state. Um, okay, Dice, well, that's me amazing. Gusto que Kirara that's the best thing ever. <laughs> She's going to be so great for exploring. And I guess that's one of the reasons why she's a trustworthy courier. Mm-hmm. And finally, with her elemental burst, she smashes the enemy with a special delivery package, which then explodes into numerous small dendro bombs. These bombs Eso no me gustó porque eso de las dendro bombs separadas no es la idea. Dealing dendro damage. And can we just appreciate Ahora, lo de la cajita sí está bien. The bombs. Y encima es su habilidad no necesita usar tanto de un tiro. Ojalá la gente no tenga bugs porque si no ya valió eso de escalar. She has kitty styled attacks, kitty styled deliveries, and she also has kitty styled bombs. No, el último no, el último no me llama la atención, pero la habilidad. La otra sí porque entre más velocidad de movimiento tenga, más va. Y hay espadas de movimiento. Y cortas. Con lo cual va a poder aplicar dentro rápido. Pero falta ver ese el ISD, ¿no? Y debe de tener, ¿no? Maybe. 
I think you might be knowledgeable about Cristobal traveling nations because Dice, you have information on Mia's story quest. I totally do. I was just being a little stinker. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so, the Sakoku Decree has been repealed for some time now, and Yoimiya has been wanting to go out and see the outside world. In version 3.7, the second act to Yoimiya's Karasius Arata story quest is about to begin! Woohoo! She will be embarking on a globe-trotting adventure, heading to Sumeru, the Nation of Wisdom, alongside the Traveler. Whoop whoop! It's a pretty far whoop, trip. Whoop. I mean, personally, <laughs> I'm really looking forward to it, too. Not that I'm biased or anything. I seriously cannot wait to experience what happens in the 3.7 update. Right? And, uh, uh huh. And, you know, traveling with a girl is easygoing and cheerful Clips and random cool black. and amazing. Dice, Not that I'm biased or anything, as you idea will be a joy. No I think she's probably, like, the best, like, travel companion. Again, no hey, uh. biased or anything. <laughs> <laughs> But to sure that that the most most the story quest, I'm going to be a good bean, and I will not say any spoilers. That way our travelers get the chance to explore the story. I'll be good. <laughs> okay. But that, when... that, that's nice of you. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, yeah, see? I'm good. <laughs> but when the time comes, I hope you Amia's new story can brighten everyone's day, just like she always does. Oh, yeah. Of course. Ding. For sure. And we're not biased. Yo no, siento no, que no, le no, hicieron no, historia no, para no, venderla. A ver si esta vez si la venden, güey. Honest. Honest. <laughs> Yo y Milla, güey, siempre kinda, le like, hacen el peino. Speaking payment. of honesty, I was honestly wondering what new companions can travelers invite for their teams in Clip version 3.7. Right. Dice. That takes us to our event wishes. I think de, 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 de. this is something our travelers are always interested in. So for further details about 3.7's event wishes, please direct your attention to the big screen. Ta-da! No, where did that come from? Ah, bueno, oh, creo que sí I puedes coger a Yoimilla. <coughs> Por fin tendré que coger a Yoimilla. Bueno, a menos que Kazuha venga en la segunda, porque si en la segunda se la acabó de pegar. Estoy viendo votaciones de a quién le van a tirar y la mayoría voto por Kazuha XD. Sí, si viene Kazuha en el segundo, le va a partir la madre. And the second half of version 3. Ah, tal está muertísima, bo. F, bo. F. CXD. Sarah, why are you talking like that? Because we're reporters. Thanks, Sarah. With the help of their... Cualquiera de los otros tres está más poderoso que ella, bo. O sea, no, no hay para dónde tirar el cuerpo. And now to Jenny with the weather. The weather is still better. El nivel de poder sería Kazuha. Al Hase. Esta... Ya en Miko y al último la pobre yo en Miyo. Ah, encuentro el cabe. Our master architect from Sumeru. Yeah, and Kave is quite the character. Even though he seems super carefree, he has Gamer. certain principles that he Dice, always clings to. Yo I'm sure as we spend va a time with him during the hangout, we'll get to know him a lot better. Pobre we're going to be besties in no time. <laughs> so travelers interested in learning more Clip about Kave will get Black. to experience his stories Dice, firsthand in version 3.7. Definitely something to look forward Intentaré to. Ver si la saco a la Yay! Yumilla, Yay! Pero con, con la, now that we've covered the secundaria. new stories coming our way, maldición. I think we can move on to some news about other fun events coming in version 3.7. What do you think? I think that's a very good idea. Vale, <laughs> okay, so not only are there events, but there will also be tons of incredible rewards and prizes, too. Ooh, I'm yeah. so excited. You oh, be. so am I. Well, so, without further ado, let me introduce the first event. In version 3.7, the Divine Ingenuity Collector's Chapter event will be available. Oh, I remember ah, this event. Va? This is the one that lets you design your own domain. Ah, oh, that's cool. Right. However, this event's gameplay has been upgraded a bit, and the development team has specifically designed some stages for everyone to challenge and get used to the rules. For example, the first stage requires you to build a mechanic to defend a monolith, and the second will be a coin collecting fiesta that everyone's familiar with. Mm, okay, yes, yeah, so fun. Son los típicos eventos de room, o sea, directamente de room. No es algo que no hayamos visto ya. Todos le agregan algo más desafío ya o algo más nuevo. There will be multiple areas available and everyone will be able to get a special item. Oh. Artificer coins. Ofres. You're going to get a lot of them. Thank you. These coins will allow people to buy various buffs from buff stations located in each area to boost their team's effectiveness. Nice. Okay, so we'll be able to keep getting stronger as we progress. Exactly. The fourth stage requires everyone to keep their characters alive while they go around collecting coins. 
The last stage features a buff bestower device capable of amplifying your opponent's capabilities, so you're gonna want to destroy that first before engaging them in battle. Or oh, not. there's so much to do! Okay, so just to confirm, we can use all of this while we're making our own domains, yes? No voy a crear un puto dominio. Lo, lo que va a hacer la gente es que va a crear lo que necesite para, para sacar las protos y a chingar a su madre, bro. No lo va a hacer, bro. And opponent y los que lo vayan a hacer son gente que les gusta demasiado ese tipo de juego. Wait, you, that's so Yo sinceramente cool. no okay, lo voy so a hacer. Like Yo voy a hacer lo que me pidan nada más. Este es el protogema y ahí nos vemos, <laughs> juego. El Mario Maker no es meta en traps. <laughs> well, hopefully they'll also sprinkle some ingenuity as well. Get it? Get that's, it? <laughs> that's literally what I just said. Ingenuity, traps, Peach tomatoes, and tomato. black. Yeah. <laughs> well, uh, traps. Minecraft sure, can as see long as it's creative. Yes. Oh dear. Uh, <laughs> this time, there will also be co-op mechanics for this game mode. So if there's a stage you can't beat on your own, you can bring your friends and try the challenges. Or uh, fall into Jenny's traps together. Yeah. And remember, domain creators also must clear their own designs before they'll be able to share them with others. Okay, seriously, how do people clear some of these stages? They seem like they're going to be really difficult. Uh, I don't have a good answer for Cristo you other than the fact that people are kind of Dice. amazing. Yeah, that's I don't know fair. if you're going to see, but there are videos out there of people si no showcasing hay their own stages, and it's exit. crazy. It's amazing. <laughs> oh, absolutely. So, I hope all our creative travelers out there won't miss this event. Remember to share your codes or videos and let everyone play your domains. Traps. Oh dear. Okay, so oh, next, trapas, we have a challenge oh, yeah. event called the Feast of the Departed Warriors. A mysterious domain has appeared near the Falcon Coast, and its depths are crawling with powerful foes. Travelers will need to rely on their martial prowess to defeat them and earn rewards. Ooh, Departed Warriors, it sounds spooky. <laughs> Dice que ahora están dando <laughs> eh, agüita para mejorar anyway, artefactos, Cristóbal, últimamente. However, let me no lo había notado hasta el otro día que me puse a revisar bien los lo, 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 cosas que te daban. Three types of dangerous Dice. adversaries awaiting sí. our travelers. They're each based on the Thunder Manifestation, Eon Blight Drake, and the Black. Bethysmal Bishop Herd, Dice. respectively. Agüita. Travelers can also add additional conditions to their difficulty multiplier in this challenge with increased difficulty resulting in greater rewards. Okay, I, I think I get the gist of this one. I heard Thunder Manifestation and my heart stopped a little bit, so full disclosure, I'm mm. probably not going to be doing this. the increased difficulty, but I hope everyone's ready for a challenge! <laughs> Cristobal yes, Gamer. This one looks like it could Dice. be tough. Don't Las worry, travelers para can still get key clips. rewards and materials by completing the challenge on lower difficulties, including Primo Gems. Oh, thank goodness. Travelers who are looking for a real challenge can try the higher difficulties for a proper fight. I heard lower difficulties, and I once again feel safe. Cool beans. <laughs> Let's move on to the next event. <laughs> okay. Lo típico, no, saco mi punto de mi chingue su madre, ¿no? For version 3.7 called Phase Trials Hypothesis. So maybe some of you remember Jamie, the Sumeru researcher who was struggling with his thesis proposal. Well, this time, he needs your help as observers in an experiment. We're pretty sure all our warm-hearted and friendly travelers will give him a hand. Also, as a little, you know, incentive, um, each experiment also offers rewards upon completion. Of course we're gonna help him. Besides, we're getting rewarded for offering our help, so what's there to lose? Exactly. Right? So, I mean, given our travelers are honorary knights of the Knights of Favonius, and heroes who have assisted the Liyue Qixing, as well as, uh, actually everyone, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, Pretty much everybody at this point, I think, yeah. Yeah. Well, helping this one researcher should be just another walk in the park. Okay, so during the event, travelers can defeat enemies to gain phase tinctures. When they get enough phase tinctures, they can use them to enter the time dilation state. In this state, they can identify the weaknesses of their opponents mid-battle and select opportune moments to capture more weaknesses in their opposition before Ah, ese ya lo hicimos antes. O sea, básicamente es eh, pegarles y cada cierto tiempo con no sé si se algo, algo te da los puntos de habilidad y los matas. Not to mention, no me he dicho un cuento bendito de este. Oh, it's really cool. Oh, it's really cool. Ándale, ese ya lo habíamos hecho el de la el de la cámara. It can take care of opponents in a snap, you know, like taking a picture. Oh, wow. I didn't know <laughs> you were going to be channeling your inner Sino. <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> 
perfect. Okay, but remember, this event requires you to use the corresponding trial characters for the challenge. Oh, good. Okay, this way. Ah, vale, ya te van a poner unos específicos. Vale, eso sí cambió. Okay, there's seriously so much for all of us to experience in version 3.7. And oh, would you look at the time? Vale, no te dejan escogerlo. Ya te los han predefinido. Okay, the third redemption code is coming right up. Let's have a look together. Here it comes. Yay! Get ready. Whoop whoop. Whoop whoop. Me gustó cómo habla esa. No, qué guapa las imágenes. Oh. Bien, ahí volvió And la chica. That's the end of today's report. It seems like all our reporters have returned to the studio now, which means we've reached the conclusion Dice. of our program. This has Versión been so much fun. Aquí. I can't believe it's over. Estrella. Sí, la verdad es que es muy sencilla. I, know. I wish we had <laughs> even more to share. So, how did you all enjoy being on the program today? Oh my gosh, it has been so, so cool Dice. being on the program. And, oh, I can't wait for her. Pare, es que es una versión de transición. Oh, she's so cute. I just... She is. La próxima versión son de transición. Lo que me preocupa, Chris, es al inicio de la 3.0 nos presentaron. A ver si lo buscas, Chris, por ahí el video de la 3.0. O antes de la 3.0, en oh la 2.9, 2.8, algo así, no recuerdo. So Nos presentaron la parte donde se quema el Imirzul. ¿Se acuerdan? Y esa parte yeah. no ha pasado. So excited, yeah. No sé si fue una idea así nada más o qué pedo. A menos que fuera un plot twist nada más para llamar más atención. And share all these details about version 3.7 with everyone. So, hope you all have a fantastic time in the upcoming update. All right, this is the end of our program. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. Bye. 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 Okay. Aguanta, 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 aguanta. Espera, 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 espera. No me jodas, weón. No mames, qué guapo, qué épico el final, weón. Está con esos 10 de 10, weón. Me acaban de comprar, weón. ¿Dónde firmo mi joya? Mis próximas 10 versiones. <risa> no mames, el viajero nadando debajo del agua, weón. Está rotísimo. Venga, chicos, muchas gracias por haber visto Esto mi reacción de Lightning. Y Dice, nada, está buenísimo, venga. Eso es lo único que salva la versión XD, pero todo ZZZZZZ. Sí, algo así. Y